Hello, sometimes when you're working with a spreadsheet, you might want to hide a particular column. You don't want to delete it, but you just don't want to have to see it. It takes up room. You can easily hide one of these columns by right clicking at the top of it and choosing Hide. It's gone, but not forgotten. It's still there, it's just hidden. But how on earth do you get it back? So sometimes in spreadsheets, if you have a column or a row that perhaps carries out some form of calculation, this particular one works out the average of these three grades, and in the column on the right, it takes that average and converts it into a grade. Now we might not particularly need to see this average column. All we need to see are the grades at the end. Now we can't get rid of the average column because of course this column here is using this number to work out the grade, but we could hide it. Now you can, in some cases, just simply reduce the width of it, but that looks scruffy. Instead, there's a handy shortcut which you can use that will hide a column or a row, but it won't be getting rid of that column. It'll still exist. If you just simply right click on the label at the top of a column or the label to the left of a row, and you right click, you can choose to hide that entire column. That snaps closed, but you'll notice these grades still work. They're still able to see that hidden column. But how can you get that column back? After all, you can't right click at the top of it to unhide, even though the option is there for all other cells, because of course you can't right click at the top of it. Well, there are a couple of different ways we can do this. It is possible, if you have very good mouse control, to grab that column. It is hidden, and you'll notice that if I move my mouse very slightly from left to right, at some points it's simply a vertical black line with two arrows, and if I move it a millimetre to the right, it becomes a split line. Now if I grab it when it's a split line, I will be able to pull that column back. But that's a little bit uh, messy, it's a little bit fiddly, and it's not always easy to see. So what's the other alternative? Well, if you know that there is a column hidden between these two columns here, you can simply click, drag across, holding the mouse button down, so you're selecting the two columns either side of the hidden one, and then you can right-click on either of these and choose Unhide and it will unhide all of the columns that are between those two selected. But what about if you've hidden multiple columns and you're not sure exactly where they are? Well, the easiest way to do that, to be able to unhide all columns, is to click on this uh, table selector, the sheet selector, at the top left of your spreadsheet, to the left of the A and above the 1. Clicking on that selects the entire uh, spreadsheet, and you can then right-click on any column heading you like and choose Unhide. You can also uh, achieve the same thing without using this right-click context menu, because in the Home tab, if you scroll along to the right-hand side, you have a Format drop-down link. That menu allows you to hide and unhide selected rows, columns, or indeed the entire sheet. And then if you select the entire sheet, as I did by clicking on this button to the left, then you're able to unhide all of the rows or all of the columns that have previously been hidden.